Hi YouTube, on board Steamship Fresh Spring again. Uh, just have a little quick look, hopefully, at the steering engine, which is uh, steam powered power steering. Um, so, power steering isn't a new thing. Uh, the way of actually controlling the rudder at the back of the ship is there's chains go right the way down, chains and rods which transmit the power right the way down the sides of the ship. So the chain actually is here, you can just see it on the chain wheel there and then it would go under these and down through the holes there. At the moment it's all tucked away in here because it's disconnected but uh, that would be what's actually powering the, the rudder. You've got two ways to control that from here. On the front of the shaft here, hopefully, uh, you've got, two, you originally would have had two ship's wheels. One would have been on this area here, so a smaller ship's wheel, maybe only two feet in diameter, and a very large ship's wheel here, which would have been about four feet in diameter. The larger one would have been used if, you, if the steering engine had failed, or if you didn't want to use it for whatever reason, um, and you would select between the two with this lever here, so you take this pin out, and then slide the dog clutches, which you probably can't quite see just there. Um, you can see there's dog clutches here and here, so you're either engaging one or the other. Um, so you could either use the larger ship's wheel, which would be manual, or the smaller one, which would then be using the steam power. You can see the cylinder there, you've got two of them, one on each side, with the valve gear in the centre, which unfortunately the light's not terribly good, so you probably can't see very well, but then the system on the end here is what's actually controlling it and telling it which way to go. So at the top here you've got two sets of bevel gears. The movement of, the, of each set relative to each other is what's controlling the movement of the steam engine so that it moves it exactly as much as you want. Because clearly you don't, if you move the ship's wheel to the left, you don't just want it to keep trying to turn the rudder. Uh, you want it to stop when you get to the position where you get to. Um, so that's what this uh, this machine does, and a uh, very clever piece of kit it is too. And originally you'd have also had a control coming off the top of here that would have gone up through the deck onto the Monkey Island. So uh, there you go. I hope you've enjoyed the uh, video and found it interesting. Anything else you want to know, please visit the website, uh, ssfreshspring.co.uk. And um, of course, hopefully we'll upload some more videos soon. Take care.